can't arrest Esme for anything right now, Spencer, but you, I can put the cuffs on you for what you did. Dante, you wouldn't actually arrest me. And charge me with what? I didn't break any laws when I handed Ace over to my father. No? How about aiding and abetting a fugitive? Did you forget your father's a wanted man? Did you forget that you had an obligation to report seeing him? It's really interesting because I would think that you of all people would understand what it's like to love a complicated father. Haven't you been struggling with whether or not to report Sonny for his many crimes all these years? I believe he once shot you over the... Spencer, what are you doing? I, I'm sorry about this, really, Dante. I'm so sorry. I don't know what's gotten into my grandson. It's been a very emotional day. Nora, it's okay. Don't worry, Spencer. I'm not going to arrest you. It's not going to help us find Ace. But I will issue a bolo for Nicholas now that we know he was in town last night. I wasn't trying to knock your old man or your love for him. I was simply trying to remind you of the lengths that family will go to for one another. Let me just give you a piece of advice, Spencer, if I may. When you love family, you know they don't always make the best or most legal decisions, right? Point taken. Yeah. My only goal is to protect my little brother. Okay. Given what I know about Esme, I believe I did the right thing by letting my father take him. The problem is Esme might have something to say about that. So, I gotta get her statement. Time to bring Esme in. This is about vengeance. I want every single one of them to pay. It's Michael. And Nicholas, Spencer, Trina, Ava. They're all gonna get what they deserve. Of course they are. And we're gonna make it happen. Did you really think I'd allow those ingrates a single moment of peace in their miserable lives after they conspired to kidnap my grandson? Ava, what can you do from behind bars? Oh, my sweet child. Incarceration's never been an impediment to justice for me. Just leave it all to mommy. Eva, has this form of justice ever involved locating a millionaire fugitive before? Uh, you know, I know that face. Your, your father used to make it all the time. You don't believe I can do this. Yeah, well, I don't exactly know what to believe anymore. Honey, we will find Ace. I promise you, but you just can't go off on your own trying to do this by yourself. Remember what I said to you last time? You are in the best possible position right now. Ryan is gone, cold in the ground or six feet under, whichever way you want to think about it. And the cops have nothing on you. Fly free, little birdie. You know, I remember something that you told me last time when I visited. Ace is everything. Without my son, I have nothing. You have never trusted anybody in your life. Trust me. Nobody loves you. Like your mom. Honey, you do everything you want. of Crimson Magazine. That wasn't the plan. Plans change. I mean, think about it. Nina didn't know anything about running the magazine when she started. Here she kind of learned as she went. And you're not that familiar with publishing, I understand, but you know how to run a company. Yeah, I do, but that's not the issue. I let you make me editor-in-chief of Crimson so I could see Nina's face when I took something that she loves. And we accomplished that. You see the way she slunk out of here? Yes, it was very rewarding, but it can end there. I don't want to make a decision this big for the wrong reason, Drew. You're taking this job. doesn't have to be just about sticking it to Nina. It can be, it can be about so much more. Think about it. I mean, we keep everything oh, that's working, oh. obviously, but then we can, we can get rid of things oh, that, that we don't agree 